Okay, hello everyone. We are back for the second round of our hot sauce challenge. And uh, we got six left. And it looks like, I've been looking at the bottles, most of them are made with habaneros. So, not a very hot pepper. Hot pepper, don't get me wrong. If you eat a habanero pepper, you're gonna feel it. Yeah, they're really spicy. Yeah, but these sauces are made with that and I'm not really getting much heat out of this challenge. Um, so the last six are mainly made with habanero. The last one though states on the bottle that it's made with one million Scoville pepper extract. So that's probably gonna be a little spicy. Yeah. All right. I'm scared for that one. Why? You're scared for the hot sauce? No, I'm scared for that, that only one. Oh. Well, it's not a person. You don't have to be scared for them. <laughs> okay. So, we brought back a shot of bourbon, or milk, I mean, just in case we need it for the second round. <laughs> I don't think we will, but... Okay. This one is roasted garlic. Butt kicking roasted, roasted garlic made with habaneros as well. So, let's see what we got. Two, three. So, it's actually pretty good. I don't like it. I think it tastes like dookie. I don't know if you've ever had dookie. Dookie doesn't taste good. It actually tastes good, but when it goes in your throat, it's kind of spicy. Yeah, it has a little bit of a kick to it. Yeah, I think it's good. But it doesn't really have any flavor, in my opinion. Do you like the taste of it? Yeah, but I... We just take a little sip of this, it's kind of spicy in there. Sure thing. Emma, taking a shot of bourbon. I'm not! Milk. Sorry, milk. Okay. That was the garlic. Next one. I this. this. Here, let me take care of it. Next one is called... Well, I gotta say it because it's part of the name. No, do not! Hot sauce from hell. Now, that guy that's on the bottle doesn't look like a very nice guy. Hope he didn't do something to this sauce. The world's hottest hot sauce, it says Beyond Hot. Also made with habaneros. So, what did they do to this that it's the hottest in the world? Oh, there's actually a Cool recipe on the side too. Scrambled eggs from hell. Two eggs, one tablespoon, half and half. You know, we have all that stuff. Some butter. Salt and ground pepper to taste. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'll try that tomorrow, Faith. <coughs> Willing that the, the sauce is tasty. Okay. Hot sauce from hell. Are you actually going to use some of these like for your food? Yeah, the ones that taste good, yeah. Yeah, some of them do taste pretty really good. Okay, so... Eighth bottle, hot sauce from Hell Challenge. Let's go. One, two, three. You got to take a little bit more than that for a challenge, huh? kick to it. You didn't take any. I did. I didn't even see a tongue imprint in it. Taste is okay. A little spicy. Take your shot of milk. What'd you think? Any feedback? Not very good. You don't like the taste of it? No. Spicy though? Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little bit of a kick. Okay, the next one is 
the hot sauce from hell, devil's revenge. So this time, the devil is even angrier than he normally is. Does that make sense? Okay. Beyond hell. Why is he wearing pink? So if you think hell's bad, we're going to see what happens beyond it, according to this bottle. Cool down. Why is he wearing a pink shirt? What is going on? Wait um, a minute. Is the devil a little... Who knows? Okay. Hot sauce from hell, devil's revenge. Ooh, that has a nice, nice color to it. It's like a habanero orange. Yeah. Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying too. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Care for the taste very much. Spicy. I would like a shot of milk. What do you think? Taste bad, good. Taste is bad. Yeah. Okay. Uh oh. This next one is butt kicking. Ghost pepper hot sauce. Now, ghost peppers, to my knowledge, have reputation for being pretty spicy and all the milk's gone. Okay, so this one is ghost pepper. Could you leave me some to even lick out of the glass? <laughs> So, butt kicking ghost pepper hot sauce. And this one is made with a. I'll get more milk. Bee Hut. What the? Jolokia, whatever <laughs> that means. One second, I'll be right back. Okay. So, I'm gonna fill up our spoons. Okay, never mind, I have absolutely no idea where the milk is. Alright, it's in the fridge. <laughs> To see what a bee hut jalokia is, if I'm saying it correctly. <laughs> and that's a ghost pepper. Pretty sure they're hotter than habaneros, to my knowledge and understanding. So, ready? One. More than a, more than a. Okay, fine, I'll try. You need like a, a good, ready? Take one bite, <coughs> swirl it around in your mouth, and we got two left. And this is butt blaster. Oh no, I don't want that to happen. Oh, this one's made also with the one million Scoville capsicum extract. So this one and the next one. You ready? There's two left. Spicy, this is not going to be Okay. Come on, we got two left. You want to finish it up? Mm -hmm. And here we go with the bust, the butt blaster. It actually says something else on the bottle. But there's a donkey, and there's a fire. Looks like there's something wrong with the dunk. Oh, never mind. Okay. What is it? So, let's. It's not going away. Okay, let's make it worse. 
and we got one left after this. Here's the butt blaster. Ready? One, two, three. Place the camera. We got a challenge. We're on video here. Okay. One, two, three, go. Did you take any? Again, the taste, not a big fan. Ah! It is a little spicy. Nothing I can't handle, though. Making my nose run. Clear up our sinuses a bit. <laughs> How do you feel about sharing some of that ice cream? Huh? This one you gotta take this the amount given on the spoon. Why? Because that's part of the, the rules of the challenge. The last one you gotta take the amount on the spoon. That's not fair. Well, sometimes life's not fair. But we're gonna take the last one made with the one million scoville capsicum extract and see what happens. and we could have a whole cow if you want. Not that I'd ever drink milk out of a cow. Okay, you ready for this? You gotta take the amount on the spoon. Just a little bit, please. Yep, it's gonna be a little bit, but you gotta take the amount on the spoon. No, that's not enough. That is a little bit, huh? I have to do the same thing. Let's just deal with it. Spontaneous combustion, here we go. Ready? Come on. One, two, Wait, can I take no, no. Don't put the spoon in the ice cream and add hot sauce on it. Like half ice cream? Okay, let's take this away for a minute. Okay, ready? You gotta take the whole spoon. One. Two, three, go. Full spoon, man. It's part of the challenge, huh? Something wrong with the lizard. That's got a little bit of a kick to it. And it doesn't taste very good. So, that was our hot sauce challenge. It wasn't too bad. I feel very okay bad. for now. Um, I got to say, I didn't like the taste of a lot of them. There was no flavor or they just plain out tasted like dookie. I've never actually ate dookie. I'm just relating it to the smell. So I could imagine what dookie tastes like. But a lot of these were not that good. I think in the beginning, maybe the chili lime was okay. I don't remember quite which one I liked, but I'd say a 10 or 11 out of 12 of them I didn't care for. The one I liked was the one, I liked um, the third one. Sriracha? Yeah. I think I minded that it was okay. So, it tastes like salsa. Goodbye everyone. Bye. We just did the hot sauce challenge and uh, Recommend doing it with this. I definitely would not. The taste isn't there for me. How about you? I, the only one that I liked was the third one. Was, uh, so tell the people what you. Sorry, sorry, wait, how do you say it? So this, out of all of the hot sauce that you've had here, would you recommend someone doing this challenge? Well, probably if they can like. If they think they can probably handle it, but... Yeah, so Emma's saying maybe, so she's like on the fence 50-50. I'm saying no. So, um... At least we did it. We'll try a different hot sauce challenge some other time and uh, see how that is. Yeah. Bye, everybody. Bye.